being Cinderella happens, I think, only once in a lifetime. At 101 years old, Sister Jean Dolores Schmidt has had a pretty good lifetime, but her beloved Loyola Ramblers are no longer the Cinderella story they were in 2018, when as a number 11 seed, they went on a roll that took them all the way to the final four. In the process, they made their then 98-year-old chaplain, Sister Jean, a celebrity. The university is just so uh, incredibly uh, um, blessed to have her uh, and just what she stands for and what she represents. But Sister Jean has been unable to be together with her beloved Ramblers basketball team this year. She sends each player an email and a prayer before and after each game. It's been lonely without seeing them because I always felt free to go to uh, practices and went to every home game. In fact, Sister Jean has not been on the Loyola campus since last year's basketball season came to an abrupt end because of COVID-19 last March. She is excited to be able to return to the NCAA tournament this year. She's filled out a bracket that has her Ramblers beating the University of Illinois in the second round and making it all the way to the Elite Eight. It's an exciting time for the university, but Sister Jean is most excited about being back around her team. These young people keep me young, even though I'm 101. I consider myself young at heart. While Loyola students and most everyone else associated with the school will have to watch the games on television, Sister Jean says she's been fully vaccinated and she's excited to watch the games in person. She's hoping for a nice long run in the tournament. In Rogers Park, John Garcia, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC 7 Chicago YouTube channel.